Jared Famous, one of their starters, is out with five fouls. Two other guys playing with four for USF. Dixon on the court for Providence with four. Jones tying his career high with 37. And a new career high. And a team that couldn't buy a three-pointer through the first 35 minutes gets another one. Jones has been unbelievable. Hopefully people stayed in their seats here because uh, Providence right now has got to find a way to come back in this ball game now and the momentum all in the Bulls' favor. Peterson gets the bucket. Providence within one. His first touch in a while. Peterson can go off, get him the ball inside. Brooks, Curry. You want the ball in those guys' hands. Mercer, baseline move, got it. Dixon couldn't stop him with the four fouls. He's been very, very consistent in this game as well. A minute and a half gone in overtime. Peterson, and he wants the ball here in the extra session. Doesn't get that one to go. Taken away by USF. Bullet pass inside. Can this be one of those program-changing games for USF? A team with just two road wins in four years of Big East play. They rally from 15 down in the second half. Jones just around the ball all the time. Dixon grabs it for the Friars. Now this is possession basketball now. Curry, strong to the bucket for Sherrod. You want the ball in his hands as much as possible down the stretch if you're the Friars. 22 for Curry. Point lead with the ball. Now it's Mercer. These, these guards have been very effective. Howard and of course Jones with, with 40 on the table right now. Working on the freshman council defensively. Good defense from the Friars, but then Crater gets the offensive board. <laughs> Four guard lineup out there for USF. Famous on the bench with five. Got to get the stops. You got to dig deep right now. If you're the Friars, the USF, big, big possession right here. Howard waving everybody off here with eight on the shot clock. Howard into the lane, left hand and way in is good. Wow, he wanted that. No denying him. The fifth-year senior calling his own number. It's a three-point lead. They're out. I'm taking them. Well, for Providence now, Peterson's been effective inside. Brooks has been very clutch. And so has this guy, Sherrod Curry. Peterson off the side of the backboard. Jones on the breakout. And Jones fouled. Big basket after big basket for the Bulls. They tie it up at the end of regulation with a three-pointer from a 6'8 freshman who had only made one all year. Third Big East road win in four years. Well, for Providence, you know the three is a weapon. Right now, though, they just got to get good shots and get it to the goal. Four for four from the line, one of the best free throw shooters in the Big East Conference. in the three-point lead. Well, for the Friars, this is just absolute stop time right now. A foul committed on Crater with 45 seconds to go. Their points off the bench tonight. The rest of the scoring coming from the starters.
Gonna move the ball now, look to penetrate. Brooks takes it in and scores. Timeout, Providence. This is a big stat night, but more importantly for USF, they're trying to find a way to win this thing. See if Providence gonna reach in. Stop this clock. Well done by USF. Got it back to Dominique Jones. He's the guy you want there. Three to tie it for Providence. Gonna be in great shape to go the distance in this one. This Jones is doing. Peterson had an opportunity. Curry's got it back. 20 seconds to go. Tried to get the lean in three. Tied up. Providence will keep it. Wow. Deal. And for Providence now, there's enough time here to get a good shot. If the three presents itself, fine. Otherwise, get it two. And they get right into your pressure. Curry to tie. No. Jones rebounds and he's fouled. Regulation and now Jones. Trying to put the finishing touches on it. To go along with his 10 rebounds and 45 points. 45 and 10. What a line. Brooks, they'll get the quick two with three seconds to go and all the quick timeout. They've been able to hang in there. Now look at the position they're in. Got to inbound this thing. That's the man. They get it into Jones. A quick foul. If the score stands, a tough one for the Flyers to try and bounce back from. It's to go in a two-possession game. The Bulls of the USF on the road for the win, coming back from double figures down in the second half. And they win it in overtime, 109 to 105.